Matt's Quick Tips. Oh yeah. If you've been playing ukulele a little while, you might have heard people refer to something called the action of your ukulele. That quite simply means how high your strings are above the fretboard. And the height of those strings or the action affects certain things. If the action is really high, it's going to be very difficult to push down on certain chords because you have to push a little harder. In other ways, it can be an advantage to have a slightly higher action. If you're a fingerstyle player and you like to dig in here, you've got a bit more room for your nails. And a higher action can lead to a bit more volume and tone coming out of your ukulele. So what are the kind of ideal parameters? Well, the two places we tend to measure action are above the 12th fret and at the nut end. You can get a special ruler for this, a steel rule, and where we measure the action at the 12th fret is from the top of the metal fret, that means the top of your 12th metal fret, this one, to the bottom of whichever string. And ideally, that action there wants to be between around two to three millimetres. Anything below 2.25 millimetres is considered generally a low action. Anything above around 2.75 millimetres tends to be considered a high action. Because I like to dig in and get a lot of volume out of my uke, and because I've been playing a while, I don't have a problem pressing down, I tend to have my uke set at a higher action, rounds about three millimetres. Most beginners prefer it round about 2 to 2.25 millimetres. The other thing that can affect it is how high the strings are this end. And a neat way, a neat little tip that I've got for checking the action there is if you put a credit card or a thick business card in your ukulele and let it go underneath the strings, between the strings and the frets, you should find that it stops somewhere around about the second or first fret. I have to force it to get it that low. If that credit card falls all the way to the nut really easily, your action is too high this end and it could do with being reduced to make playing your ukulele so much more comfortable. These are going to come every day, so make sure you click subscribe and then you'll get an email telling you when the new one is available. If you'd like some more information and my longer videos, you can see my playlists or check out my website, mattsteadukulele.com.